Now to a remarkable cultural exchange between the country's oldest Australians, some of our newest and some of our toughest. Aboriginal leaders and Muslim students in Melbourne are working together on an art project which celebrates their shared history dating back to the arrival of Makassan fishermen in the 1600s and later the Afghan cameleers. The project also involves the Australian Federal Police, which is looking to build bridges and understanding with those who can be wary of authority. Karen Percy reports. They're strangers, but kindred spirits too. I love doing that stuff, especially with um, other cultures, bringing our, our music together. Elim College in Melbourne's north is embracing the upcoming NADOC celebrations. You've got the cameleers happening in the middle. Um, wow. so they're travelling through the desert. Yeah. And the uh, Aboriginal uh, person playing did you redo oh, on beautiful. that. Well, let's just say that's you, Ron. <laughs> <laughs> this project, called Connection to Country, depicts some of the earliest encounters between Aborigines and Muslims. The root of Australia is obviously Indigenous, indigenous Australia. So when you've got um, the modern Australia, which is, you know, all these multiculturalism, combining with the root of Australia, you know, it's kind of a good representation of what Australia really is like today. So in our community we have a lot of mosaic artists and our mosaic is a way to bring people together and connect to us and the cultural diversity. Helping hands have come from an unlikely quarter, the Australian Federal Police. Whilst we're breaking pieces of glass and putting it down on the mosaic, we're also talking to the kids about um, careers, what they want to do in the future, and also some aspects about being safe online. The students were more accustomed to seeing police in the media dealing with problems in their communities than on campus. They were quite reluctant at the beginning, but as they get to know the personalities and their sincerity and their genuinity, then it, you bond relationships. The mosaic was inspired by a school visit to the Islamic Museum of Australia in April. My favourite part is the cameleers, simply because during one of the expeditions where the horses couldn't make it, the camels made it out. It's got to be Uluru. It's got to be Uluru. And it just looks cool. It's like an Aboriginal painting as well. Um, there's a story in it. We will not the piece will be hung at a ceremony during NAIDOC week. Karen Percy, ABC News, Melbourne.